in this video I'll show you how to reset your Epson EcoTank ET2400 printer. And when I'm saying reset, I mean the Wi-Fi, since this is the only data that gets kept on the memory of the printer. So by resetting, the printer won't be connected to the internet anymore, and you'll have to redo the whole setup again after doing what I'll show you next. By the way, if you're trying to do this because your lights are blinking, and you cannot even shut down your printer, I have a completely different video on my channel showing you how to fix this problem first before being able to reset your printer. So just take a look at my other videos, you're gonna find it, and after you can come back and finish the process of resetting it the way I'm, I will show you in just a few seconds. So to reset, first step, go on the control panel, make sure your printer is turned on by pressing once on the power button. And then what we need to do is to press this button over here, the I button and the power button both at the same time during about five seconds until these lights start blinking like this. And now wait. Okay, the light went off. And now it starts blinking, so I can remove my fingers. Just wait until the printer stops making any noise and that these lights stop blinking. Usually it takes about one minute, two minutes, three minutes. Be, be patient and come back. This means that we are now able to put the printer into pairing mode so you can connect it to a new Wi-Fi network using your phone or a computer. To do this, you just need to keep press this Wi-Fi button about five seconds until the lights starts blinking. One, two, three. Okay, they start blinking at two seconds so I can release my finger from the button. And when you see these lights going from one to another, it simply means that the printer is in pairing mode. You have about, I think, three, four minutes to pair it with a new device. If you do not do it in this time frame, both of these lights will start blinking at the same time. What you need to do in this case is simply press once on the Wi-Fi button to turn them off and put the printer in pairing mode once again by pressing the Wi-Fi button two, three seconds until you see the lights going like this. And then continue the setup on your phone or on your computer. So thanks for watching. I hope this was useful. If so, please leave a like, comment down below, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.